What's up all you serious people? PS Productions here. I'm Julia and it's time to get serious. So today I'm be watching one of our videos that our patrons has chosen for one of their reward tiers. If you donate $20 a month, you're able to choose a video for one of us to react to. Well, and this time it's going to be one of us, I believe, but usually it's me and Caitlin. Um, but since we got to do this, we're doing it this way. So hopefully, Bradley, you're satisfied with just me because this is like going to get sweetheart. But we do appreciate being a patron. I'm excited to watch this. St. George and the Dragnet. This was, um, as you described, it was on the show, Dr. Demento Show. I'm not sure what that is, but I believe it's pretty legit because Bradley always sends us cool stuff. I like the cherry pie one he sent us last month. If you have not seen that, for sure check that out. It's really good. But I'm excited to watch this, Bradley. So without any further ado, let's watch the stop, ma stop motion animation, which is a great freaking lost art, I believe, that should be more made of. Made more of? I don't know. I've been in quarantine too long. Anyway, let's just start watching. Oh, this is a dragnet. The legend oh, you are about to hear is true. Only the needle should be changed to protect the record. This is the countryside. My name is St. George. I'm a knight. Saturday, July 10th, 8.05 p.m. I was working out of the castle on the night watch when a call came in from the chief. A dragon had been devouring maidens. Homicide. My job. Slay him. Call I me, love Chief. This. Yeah, it's the dragon again, devouring maidens. The king's daughter may be next. Mm -hmm. You got a lead? Uh, nothing much to go on. Said you take that 45 automatic into the lab to have him check on it? Yeah. You were right. I was right? Yeah. It was a gun. 8.22 p.m. I talked to one of the maidens who had almost been devoured. Could I talk to you, ma'am? Who are you? I'm St. George, ma'am. Homicide, ma'am. I want to ask you a few questions, ma'am. I understand you were almost devoured by the man. Is that right, Dragon? It was terrible. He breathed fire on me. He burned me already. How can I be sure of that, ma'am? Believe me, I got it straight from the dragon's mouth. 11.45 p.m. I rode over the King's Highway. I saw a man. Stopped to talk to him. Pardon me, sir. Could I talk to you for just a minute, sir? Sure, I don't mind. What do you do for a living? I'm a knave. Didn't they pick you up on a 903 last year for stealing tarts? Yeah. So what, do you want to make a federal case out of it? No, sir. We heard there was a dragon operating in this neighborhood. We just want to know if you've seen him. Sure, I've seen him. Mm -hmm. Could you describe him for me? What's to describe? You see one dragon, you've seen them all. Would you try and remember, sir, just for the record? We just want to get the facts, sir. Well, he was, you know, he had orange polka dots. Yes, sir. Purple feet, breathing fire and smoke. Mm -hmm. And one big bloodshot eye right in the middle of his forehead and uh, like that. Notice anything unusual about him? No, he's just a run-the-mill dragon, you know. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir, you can go now. Hey, by the way, how are you going to catch him? I thought you'd never ask. A dragon net. 3.05 p.m. I was riding back into the courtyard to make my report to the lab. Then it happened. It was a dragon. Ah! Hey, I'm the fire-breathing dragon. You must be St. George, right? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. I see you got one of them new 45 caliber swords. That's about the size of it. <laughs> you slay me. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. What do you mean? I'm taking it in a 502. You figure it out. What's the charge? Devouring maidens out of season. Out of season? You never pinned that rap on me? Do you hear me, cop? Yeah, I hear you. I got you in a 412, too. A 412? What's a 412? Overacting. Let's go. On September the 5th, the dragon was tried and convicted. His fire was put out and his maiden devouring license revoked. Maiden devouring out of season is punishable by a term of not less than 50 or more than 300 years. That's quite a time space to be, you know, incarcerated. But that was funny. Oh, that was so stupid and cute. All oh, those jokes are like dad's jokes, to be honest. Kind of like, like, you get the gun back? Yeah, you send it for analysis of the gun. We knew it. And just like the old lady was just kind of like, I heard it straight from the dragon's mouth. It's just like, oh, the dad jokes are always my favorite. I'm a big dad joke maker, so I'm right there with it. Thank you so much, Bradley. This is like super cool. 
cool. You always like, I love our patrons. They always find the coolest stuff for us to watch. And I'm always excited to watch it because it's something I would never find. So it's just always exciting for me. So thank you so much, Bradley, for sharing this and showing this to me because I would not have found this. And actually, this is really funny and really well done. So I'm super down for it. Did you guys enjoy this? Did you guys know what um, the show is? What is the show? Mr. Demento show? I don't, I feel like I don't know what that is. I'm a little bit too young, but it's okay because I still enjoy what came before. I can enjoy this. But I feel like this is like the original CGI Play animation a little bit was the original way you would do that before computers um so i love this this is a great um did you guys enjoy this you know did you guys think this is a little bit different you know if you enjoy it please give the video a big thumbs up and thank you so much bradley i really can go over how that was just so cool i loved it um speaking about thanking patrons i got some patrons to thank over on patreon.com let's go do that so first off the bat thank you so much bradley h Woo, for suggesting this video and also for being a monthly supporter to us. We love you. We cherish you. And also David C, David S, Esteban, Jane, Kevin, Vicky, and Warren P. Woo! Yay! We love you guys. Thank you so much for supporting the channel financially. Most of the these tough times. Um, you were a big help for us. And with your support, we're able to make these videos more common and just more consistent. Mostly in this kind of time. So we thank you. Um, if you'd like to be, become a patron, go over to patreon.com slash please series productions. And we have awards to starting at $1 a month. That's all it is. Um, and you get, for that one, you get exclusive previews to all reactions and everything we pretty much put on our channel. You'd be the first to watch it, first to like it, first to comment, and all that good jazz. And the reward tiers just go up from there. This reward tier is a $20 reward tier per month. And it's one of, one of my favorites because I really find stuff that I, I would, I watch stuff I would never find originally. So it's my favorite. Thank you so much. And if you can't support the channel financially, we understand it's a crazy time out there. Um, the best thing to do for us is just hit that subscribe button. Boop. Um, we're trying to get to 10,000 subscribers because if we do, we're able to partner with YouTube and then use their studios and facilities and unlock things on our channel that we can unlock yet because we haven't hit the 10 cake mark yet. So um, please subscribe. Thanks for watching and stay safe, healthy, and stay serious out there, guys. Bye. <laughs>